All right, what's up, YouTube? Welcome back to Jordan's Guitar Channel. I am your host, Jordan. Today, we'll be talking about the Fisk Influence Modern Pickups. Now, as some of you longtime viewers of the channel know, I have been struggling to love these pickups. And uh, the reason for that is they sound great, man. They are great pickups. But to my ears in the room, they've got a little bit too much top end. When I go to record, I have to draw a lot of the top end out. Normally, what I'm having to do... I'm running a Friedman Bucks and Boost with the EQ on, and then I run a six band EQ in top on top of that, in front of it rather, and I drop down the high end. That way I get a more pleasing tone, a much more recordable tone. And I'm also running a Rev G8 noise gate to cut the noise. So being as a Fish Influence Modern is such a prominent pickup in metal today. And so many new guitars are coming out with it. I'm a big E2 fan, and E2 has kind of moved to the Fish Influence Moderns. So I have been on this quest to really love them. And I have found a way to do it. So basically what I am running, what we're going to hear first, is I put the 24-volt mod into my Solar A1.6 ATG, running the Fish Influence Moderns. Now we're probably going to be focusing on the bridge pickup because we play metal, this neck pickup can go to hell. So, I'm gonna give you an example of the 24 volt mod and then I'll switch over to the nine volt regular and you can hear the differences. Okay, so let's start out with some chuggage and some lead rips with the 24 volt mod. <laughs> sounds fantastic I actually like the fish influences now with the 24 volt mod so we're going to put the amp on standby so I don't accidentally electrocute myself because that would suck so here's the 24 volt mod I'll put this in here so this is the 24 volt mod if you're using these type of plastic battery covers and stuff like this you want to get the one that has this little cover that it goes into, but it runs off these 123A batteries. Um, I think for just the adapter, and then, I mean, this is all it is. It just goes into the 9 volt slot. And then you put this cover over it, and it kind of fills the void in, you know, because it's much smaller than the 9 volt battery, right? And then the batteries themselves are the 123A. I get these off Amazon for like $4. If you want links to get to these, comment down below and I will provide links where you can find this stuff. So, in my opinion, the 24 volt mod kind of opens up things more. Less compression. The high end is a little bit more pleasing to the ears. It's not as harsh. It kind of smooths it out a little bit. And the presence is really, really nice in the room. So now, we've got the 9 volt battery in here. Let's hear the difference. <laughs> we didn't turn the hand back on. Now right off the bat, man, you notice that kind of harshness in the top end? in the room um, it is it's very harsh man now I understand yes I could adjust all kinds of settings and stuff like that to suit it more to my taste but like most guitar players man I have several guitars that I play with and the settings that I use on my amp and my pedals you don't want to change that stuff man and I'm primarily an EMG and bare knuckle guy and I don't have to change anything 
Um, I might choose a different overdrive from time to time, but I don't want to come over here and keep messing with my settings and stuff like that when I pick up this guitar with the Fish Influences. So what the 24 watt mod has achieved for me is that I get a more pleasing to the ear sound, something more usable, something easier to work with because I do record music and I make these YouTube videos and I spend a lot of time playing guitar. In fact, I'm bleeding. <laughs> I'm bleeding, and I don't know if you can see that or not, but there's blood on my strings. So, yeah, I've been pretty metal this morning. But, guys, let me, don't, uh, let me know down in the comments what you heard, what you think, if you hear any difference at all. I'd be very curious to hear your thoughts. If you like what you saw and heard here today, please subscribe to the channel. Like, comment, share, hit the notification bell. I Right now, I'm putting out a video a week. Normally, I put out two Life's been crazy, man. 2023, brother. But, um, yeah, man. Comment down below. Let me know what you thought. And uh, until next time, guys. Much metal, much love, and much peace. Later, fellas.